All right, everyone. So for your final assessment, we are looking at the Paleolithic to the Neolithic eras. Step one, you're going to watch this video that I'm creating right now, and I'm going to be going over the directions. So where it says video link, this video is going to be posted right here. And it's super important that you guys watch this video so you understand all of the directions to this final assessment, also called a project. Step two, for your final assessment project, you are going to answer this question in a project form. Did fire or farming have the greatest impact on society? You will use videos and articles provided to help you answer this question. You are going to pick which one you believe had the greater impact. There will be four different options you can choose from for your project. You are going to be picking one option only. So the four options are, number one, write a paragraph. Number two, create a video. Number three, create a PowerPoint. Or number four, create a storyboard. Each of these options are attached to this assignment. Reminder, only pick one and the directions are stated on each page, which I will show you in just a moment. Step three, review the rubric below going over how you will be graded. Step four, you should use the graphic organizer to help you organize your thoughts, shown below. And step five, you're going to go back to see the four options attached to this assignment and pick which one you want to do. So your first task is you're going to decide which one had the greater impact, fire or farming. Once you pick which one, then you are going to pick one of these four options to create your project on. I'm going to show you this rubric and the graphic organizer now. It is shown below on this OneNote page, but I'm going to just make it bigger for you so I can explain it. Okay, so here is the rubric, how you will be graded. You need to have a claim stated. Your claim is either fire had the greater impact on society or farming had the greater impact on society. That's your statement. And you will get zero points if you don't state it, one point if it's kind of attempted to be stated, and two points if it's correctly stated. You cannot get three points on this claim. Evidence one, two, and three. So now you need three pieces of evidence to support your claim. So if your claim is fire had the greater impact on society, then you need to give me three pieces of evidence to support why fire had the greater impact. The same thing with farming. Now these three pieces of evidence will be provided to you in a video and article, which we'll get to in a moment. You will be graded on if it's organized and easy to follow, and if it's creative, held our attention. Now, for organized and easy to follow, you could get zero points, one point, or two point being the maximum. So there is no three points allowed for organized and easy to follow. Same thing with creative. Your total points on this assignment is 15 points. So the rubric is telling you exactly how we will be grading you. Now, this is the graphic organizer that you can use to help you organize your thoughts. So for your claim statement, you can write fire had the greater impact on society, or you can write farming had the greater impact on society. Then these three pieces of evidence are found from the video or the article that is provided to you. Okay, so again, for the graphic organizer, your claim statement can be fire had the greater impact on society, or it can be farming had the greater impact on society. Remember, you are only choosing one. You have to pick fire or farming. Now your first piece of evidence can be found from the article or the video. So for fire, if you put keep predators away, that's why is that important? So the explanation, you need to explain why keeping predators away is important. For farming, if you chose your first evidence as people don't have to be nomadic anymore, why is that important? And then for evidence number two and evidence number three, that will be pulled from either the article or the video that will be attached on the assignment. Okay, so remember, you are using the article or the videos posted on each assignment to help you fill in this graphic organizer. Now, going back, on our page, we gave you four different options to choose. So I'm going to go through all four of these options. 
option number one. You are going to be watching a video of me explaining this choice to you, but this one is talking about a paragraph. For this one, you're going to be writing a paragraph. Option two, you are going to be creating a video. Option three, you are going to be creating a PowerPoint. And option four, you are going to be creating a storyboard. Now, at the top of each of these options, I will be creating a video describing how to do each one. Okay, so when you go into your social studies class, you go up to more and click assignments. When you will see this final assessment project, you open it up. This is what you will see. This is a student view. Final assessment project. It is worth 15 points. It's a graded assignment. The instructions tell you open the purple OneNote page first. You're going to be reading the directions. So there are many different things posted here. However, you need to always open the purple OneNote page first. That's where we go over all of the directions. So we had opened this up. And this is the video that I'm creating now and explaining all of these options to you. Right, once we go through this, then you're going to go back, so close, and you're back to this page. Now you can see option one, two, three, and four. This is where you will choose which option you want to do. So option one is going to be writing a paragraph. So step one, you're going to watch a video of me just explaining the steps of the paragraph, which I will post right up here. Step two says pick fire or farming. If you pick fire, you're going to use this video and article to find your three supporting evidence. If you pick farming, you're going to use this video and article to find your three reasons why farming had the greater impact. And your step three is after you choose, then below write a paragraph using complete sentences stating a claim sentence, which one you think had a greater impact on society. Then support your choice by including three reasons why and explaining those reasons. Look back at the rubric to see how you will be graded. It's option one, option two, I will be posting a video up here describing this one um, more thoroughly, but option two is a video. So step two, you're going to pick fire or farming. If you pick fire, use this video or article. If you pick farming, use this video or article to help you find the three reasons why. Step three, after you choose, then you will use your iPad to record a video stating a claim sentence. So you go onto your iPad and you would go to where your photos are and you're going to record a video. In that video, you need to tell me whether fire or farming had the greater impact. Then you will support your choice by including three reasons why and explaining those reasons in your video. Remember to look back at the rubric to see how you will be graded. Also, you're going to watch the video that I will post at the top of this page describing how to upload your video. Okay, that's option number two, video. Option three, we have a PowerPoint. Remember at the top of your PowerPoint in the top right hand corner, you need to click the little square with the line through it, a pencil paper icon, so you can edit this in the PowerPoint app. Step one, you're going to watch a video of me explaining this choice. Again, all of these videos will be posted. Uh, step two, again, you're picking fire or farming. If you pick fire, use this video or article. If you pick farming, use this video or article to help you find three reasons why it had the greater impact. Step three, after you choose, then add more slides to this PowerPoint. So you would just click the Add Slides button. Make sure in your PowerPoint you state a claim sentence, which one you think had a greater impact on society, then support your choice by including three reasons why and explaining those reasons. Look back at the rubric to see how you will be graded. So that's option three, PowerPoint. The last one is option number four, Storyboard. Again, the same format, you're going to watch a video of me describing this one more thoroughly. You're picking fire or farming. If you pick fire, use one of these two to help you find your three reasons why. If you pick farming, use one of these two resources to help you find your three reasons. Step three, you're going to go to this website and I will go over more about what the storyboard contains 
in the video I will post on the top of this page. Okay, so I just ran through all of the four options. Um, make sure when you go to each of these four, you click at the top and there will be a video describing each of them.